So I'm starting off by sketching out the ear shape on the light colored felt. I'm using a pencil so that you can't see if I mess up and then going over it with a marker. Then I'm just taking some fabric scissors and cutting out the shape. This is what it will look like when you fold it over later. And I just trimmed off some of the edges that looked messy. Next, I got another piece of felt. This one happened to be sticky on one side, but you don't have to have this kind. I ended up having to still glue the pieces together anyway. So you just want to make sure that you double up so that it's not too floppy. I'm just trimming the edges again to make it look clean. And then you're just going to repeat this step, make two of them. So after making two of those, I started making little loops at the bottom of the ears so that I could attach the clip here. I did this by just cutting a small strip of felt and then hot glued it into place to create the loop. Next, I took some white acrylic paint and a paintbrush and painted the inside of the ear. Notice that the paint really starts to soak into the felt, so you may need to apply a few coats. Then I painted the edges of the ears, making it thicker at the top and gradually getting thinner as you go down. And then I blended it all out using my finger. Next, with the back of a small paintbrush, I dipped it in the white acrylic paint and started making dots, starting at the top and working my way down. And I think it looks a lot better if all of the dots are not the same size. And I put more at the top of the ear. Then using a hot glue gun, I'm just putting a little bit of glue at the bottom and pinching the ends together to create the ear shape. So the two pieces of felt actually came undone when I pinched them, so I still had to glue the layers together. Then you just let them sit and dry, and then you can add your clips and you're ready for some Halloween fun. And this is the final look. Don't forget to go check out my Halloween makeup tutorial that goes along with this. And also the floral headband tutorial to get the whole look. All of the links will be in the info box below. Thanks for watching.